as is the case with most government regulations, this one will likely favor large corporations and it'll just add to the cost of doing business for small family farms, which might inevitably, alongside the other myriad of red tape, lead to more consolidation within the beef industry. Now, the comment period for this proposal ended last April, but with the inclusion of this $15 million outlay in the federal spending package, well, I wouldn't be surprised if you see this proposed rule becoming finalized in the very near future. But even if it does, it won't actually change the parameters for which cattle and bison must be tagged. It'll just require those tags to be electronic chips. And so, on the one hand, the claim that the federal government has a plan in place to track all cattle in America is not true, at least for now. But that's not to say that it won't be true in the future and that this is just the first step in that direction. And if you thought that was interesting, well, hit that subscribe button and get more videos just like this.